In this video, we're going to take a look at how to get started with SketchUp Pro 2022. Once you have completed your order for SketchUp with us, you will receive an email with everything you need to know, including a link to download SketchUp. Once you click that link, you will come to this page. You can download SketchUp Pro 2022 for both Windows and Mac from the download link buttons here, and you can also download older versions as well. Once your download is completed, you will find an .exe file for Windows or a .dmg file for Mac on your computer. Run this file to begin the installation process. It's usually a good idea to make sure you run as administrator. You will be prompted to select your installation language, and you've also got the option of changing the installation directory. It's usually best to leave the installation directory as the default. Once the installation is done, click Finish. Now that SketchUp is installed, you'll see that this one installer has installed three programs. There is SketchUp Pro, which is the 3D package, Layout, which is the 2D package, and Style Builder, where you can create custom line styles to use in your projects. You can freely delete the .exe file or the .dmg file. Now let's run SketchUp and show you how to activate it. Once you open SketchUp, you'll find the Welcome to SketchUp screen. Down at the bottom, you'll see a small link that says Add Classic License. You only need to use this if you have one of the older serial key and authorization code licenses. For most licenses, including single user SketchUp Pro subscription licenses, click Sign In. This will then open your default web browser where you can sign in with your email address and password. If you have any difficulty signing in, or if you haven't set a password yet, you can do so by clicking the Forgot Password link on this page. Once done, you'll see this message that you're signed in to all things SketchUp and you're free to close your web browser. Back in the SketchUp application, you should now see the expiry date of your license in the top right hand corner. You can find out more about your license by clicking Licensing in the bottom left corner. If you ever need to deactivate your license, click Manage Subscription here. This will open your Trimble account. When prompted, you will want to pick the option that says Purchased via CAD Software Direct. Click My Products. Then View Included Applications. Then find SketchUp Pro and click Manage Devices. Now you'll see a button that says Deauthorize All. Once clicked, this will reset the activation of any licenses under the email address that you're logged in with. This means that you'll be free to install SketchUp to a new computer and activate it. Under the Files tab, you'll see your recent files, or you can start a new one from the templates provided. If you'd like to create 2D plans, then Layout is the best choice. The process to sign in is exactly the same, and uses all of the same details. Again, under the Files tab, you can see your recent files, or you can start a fresh one from the templates provided.